to me, this third amended plan of adjustment is truly a breakthrough. We have a fully viable plan, uh, a plan that uh, includes compromises that reflect the good faith of all of the participants involved, that uh, the plan reflects Puerto Rico's reality, and it reflects the legal standing, as we've seen from the court rulings uh, of bondholders and their creditors. I've said many times over the years that I believe consensual deals are what we should be aiming for, that they're the best deals. Uh, consensus is important for confirmation, and consensus uh, by the court is the goal of any debt restructuring under U.S. bankruptcy law and under PROMESA. Under the umbrella of Judge Chapman's mediation, a group of bondholders approached us with a creative realistic and viable deal. It worked. This deal that we've put together with these this group of bondholders, together with the creditors we already had on board, has gotten us to a good, confirmable, uh, very consensual plan. Now, it's not as consensual as we'd like. We would like for all of the bondholders to agree to the plan, and, and some of them have not agreed agreed at this point. We understand that the terms of the plan, which reflect the current realities, may be difficult to accept for some, but we still hope we can get more bondholders to join the agreement and that this will end PREPA's bankruptcy once and for all.